what's up? So I just got a message from my doctor. They said that my prescription is ready for pickup. Uh, originally, when they put the the uh, they put the RX in for for the pharmacist, the insurance they ran it through. They they denied it actually. Um, so then I had to just get that appealed. So I, I contacted my doctor. They appealed it. They wrote the, the insurance company, you know, letting them know that this is for trans care and that it's needed, and they got it appealed. So my testosterone is officially covered by my insurance now, which is amazing. And so I'm getting ready to go over there. It's ready at CVS. And I'm just really happy that like I don't have to pay for it all out of pocket entirely. I just need to get all the supplies actually while I'm over there. So in general, you need the testosterone, obviously. So you need the tea. You need the syringe. syringe. There's two needles to draw it up. You need alcohol prep pads, uh, band-aids, and a sharps container. So I'm going to go check out all that stuff see what I can find. I'm very particular when it comes to certain things. Uh, everything, really. Uh, I just, I don't know. It has to have, like, a certain look and feel to it. Like, it just, it has to have some type of purpose. Like, that was some care and attention that went into some detail that went into, like, the look and feel of these, the things. I just don't like ordinary stuff. It just, I don't know. If it can look cool, like, why not? So, I like to look for, like, the cool things that people don't usually have, you know? I just like to, like, just be a little different. Obviously, for when it comes to band-aids, something that's not too too childish. So we'll see what they have. Here's my car. He needs a bath. Like he's filthy. Can't really tell from here, actually. Like almost at all. He looks cool, but really in real life, man, I, I have to be honest. It's been like a year, maybe, since he had like a real proper wash. But he looks good right here. Okay, ghosty, I see you, boy. Just excited to have my own version of tea. Like, I haven't seen the, the sample bottles, of course, but, like, see it online. Other people would like to know that, like, I'm holding my own little thing in my hand. Like, I'm looking forward to that. That's going to be so dope. It's going to be so dope. I just can't wait. I feel like I can't wait is, like, my favorite saying. Not even my favorite. It's just, like, it keeps coming out because, literally, like, I can't. Like, this whole process is just so exciting. Like, the whole thing just... I'm just so anxious as I'm just so ready to just for it to just be starting like it is started don't get me wrong but like for it to just keep going and like I'm just for that next step like oh what's the next thing or what is it gonna feel like you know like all that stuff like I really truly I can't wait so when you hear me say that like it's not to be repetitive but like really like that's just the feeling that comes that I get like it's just so exciting it's so exciting it's still like a shocking kind of thing. It's almost just like, wow, like this is really happening. It's like liberating. It feels so good. So when you hear me say those things, yeah, I can I'll ease into this and I'll loosen up and I'll like have other things to share. But like really, like I'm almost still in a state of shock, to be honest with you. It's just like, whoa, this feels so, 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 so good. So good. And so I literally can't wait. I'm going to head over with my double check and make sure I have it this time <laughs> I have my HSA card uh, what was really cool about that when I was at Target just a minute ago so I forgot my card I was there I was like ready to check out I had everything on the counter and she's like yeah and I'm like uh it wasn't a lot so I could pay for it but it really wasn't about that it's really about the principle of the matter and I had already been putting money aside for something that could arise as you do with HSAs and this is my moment that has now come up, so why would I not want to use that money that's already been put aside? So that was more of why I came back to get the card. Um, it's it's really it's really funny how things work in uh, how things work in life. Like I love it, I love it. It's funny. I believe in two things. Like things happen. Like I'm not a big believer in things happen for a reason. Like it's not that I don't believe in this. It's not what I what I say. It's just that I set out to do things. Serendipity, right? Like just by chance I like that word it's beautiful things happen by chance and um but the, you realize later that it's like oh there is a reason why it was like that because this whole time for like a year and a half or like two years I've been putting $25 aside each check which is not a lot but it's something it matters it it, it adds up and literally at this point it's added up to a, a decent amount of money that's now going to cover this transition you know for for a while so 
uh, I got to the register, she rung it up, she told me what how much it was, it was like, so for three months supply of the two different needle sizes and the one syringe, and then a month supply of tea, it came up to $23 or something like that, and again, I've been putting $25 aside a month, so just think about that, like, I, I basically was already paying for it before I ever knew that I was going to be doing it, and I love that, that's special things align again things work out how they were meant to when it's time and you understand it in the moment was like oh that's cool that's why that was that way so yeah I'm covered by insurance I have money already aside so it's looking good you know and obviously expenses will 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 really ramp up later when it comes to the surgeries and it comes to you know some unexpected things or whatever it is but just just knowing that like I just have some cushion already like it just makes me feel better it makes me feel good it makes me just like know that like okay this is this is feasible and it's happening so let's go get it all right hopefully it's not too bright out here I just got to Target going to CVS countdown is on we have a few minutes and i will have my own supply of testosterone the moment is here so i'm in target and i'm trying to find some really cool looking things so this brand i like called welly they have really cool stuff good looking band-aids so it's more of what i was looking for so there's one right here called bravery I was a little nervous in there like I'm trying to like do this camera thing out in the open I'm not uh, an outgoing person too much to where I, I'm really reserved so doing this vlogging kind of style out in the open and I just it's not it's gonna take some time <laughs> so what I just got some granite so let's at least show you the test off some of them, and the rest I'll show you when I get home that's really just about this it's like my man juice right here So my name, my Capri Sol, testosterone, Cypionate, 200 milligrams, half a milliliter, intramuscularly, every week, which is a really good dose, like, uh, from what I understand. Generally, you don't start out like this, but, you know, uh, this is what I have, and I'm, I'm excited for it. So this is what it looks like, because this little bottle like this um, this is my tea my first ever dose first ever little vial of it yeah just really wanted to showcase that tea and um, I just feel really I feel amazing that it's like in my possession now like it's mine like it's right here like it's kind of crazy to know that like it I have it in my hand but there's really nothing that I can do until Thursday you know like it feels good it just feels right and I'm really impatient and something that I've always tried to work on and I've gotten better with it but just to know that I have this in my hands and it's in my possession and like I'm that I'm so close but so far from from my first shot just because it's right here in my hands but the date is not you know I basically have a week from now before I can actually go there find out how to do the injection like of course I can see it online like different things so it's like knowing that you have the the means to do it and you can find out online how to do the shot it's out there there's plenty of videos there's plenty of articles there's plenty of everything but I can't do that I signed something I said I would not do that I have to wait till I go in and meet with my primary care doctor and we walk through it and he's there guiding me and I get that it's like the formality of it like I definitely I understand I do I really do but it's just a little bit harder when, like, you literally have it in your possession and you just have to wait. And you, it's something that obviously is so exciting for anyone to go through it and just, like, so close but so far. But we're almost there. Okay, so continuing from when I was in the car and I showed you the testosterone, um, <clears throat> I'll just kind of run through the rest of what I have. And then you get a bag of needles and syringes so you have two sizes of needles 
one size to draw the T, the other side is to inject it into your leg. So you have two different ones that you use. You interchange them off depending on what part of the process you're in of shooting this up. We have the syringe. And then the two needles. So two needles. One's an 18, and one's a 22. And actually that, it wasn't supposed to be that. I think one was supposed to be a 23, or I don't know, there was a slight difference for what my doctor actually ordered me, but they didn't have it uh, in stock at the CVS that I went to, so they asked if they could substitute that out. I double checked with my doctor to make sure that that would be okay, and he said, yeah, it was fine. So I think one of those is different, and I'll probably try to get the one that I need on the next time that I, um, so this is a three month supply of the needles and syringes. So the next time I need after three months, the needles, I'll try to get the one I was supposed to have. Um, so that just, I just, I don't like substitutions. If there is one thing that he ordered, like something he wanted me to have, I want to just have that thing. I don't want something else. I don't have my alcohol wipes on me, but anyway, they're really just a basic box of alcohol swabs. Really nothing special at all. There wasn't anything cool. Just a standard like Target up brand uh thing of alcohol swabs but aside from that so you would swab and needed some band-aids i wanted just some really simple circle ones that were like black or it, i don't know something like that but i was open to seeing what they have so i got these bravery bandages right here so those are really nice and also bravery balm Last thing to get is the sharps container. I've been going around and around on which one I want to get. Um, what size is best? Manageable color? Like I want something frosted clear. I've only seen mostly red. Um, so that's just the last thing I need. But since I'm going to the doctors for the first shot, I don't really need it yet. But I would need it for the following Thursday. So I have a little bit more time to find one. So here's everything that I need. Minus the sharps container.